final variable values for A, B, and C? Yes. Yeah. Okay, let's see. What did what did we get for A three. at the end? Three. Uh, three. 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 A variable three. So, yeah, so, so the class that I'm teaching is designed to offer fundamentals of programming so that if students are interested in pursuing a career in tech or, or learning programming on their own, they can have the, the foundation that is necessary to be able to jump into online courses and online resources. I have nine students. A lot of people are coming with degrees from their home countries that can't be recredentialed, so some of them are engineers or nurses. I was uh, a financial manager in our college too, and I was uh, a teacher. I'm a computer scientist. I create the website. Uh, so I, I know something like in this field. And their uh, certifications can immediately be uh, become activated in the U.S. So for a lot of students, um, computer programming or IT is a really attractive field because you don't need to have any degrees or certifications. You just have to demonstrate that you can program and that you are a fluent programmer. This is my key. I want to continue to take another course called medical coding. And I think it can help me to, do, to make better my life. And I think um, this um, class can help me to, to realize my, my, my dream. I want to become a businessman. So I'm taking this class um, because of my son. He's eight years old and he knows how to do coding. And he always talk about computer and I didn't know anything about it. Since I started this class, I started getting interested. So now I'm interested in taking a more computer. Uh, first, it was challenging to me, but after due practice, by helping our teacher, it's very easy. Yes. It needs time, <laughs> now and